Yo, what's up, folks? How y'all doing out there today? I'm out here in Columbus, Ohio, National Conference uh, with my company, Greg, get ready for my next meeting. I had a had a few quick minutes before I had to get ready, so I figured I went and go, go ahead and give y'all another video before I got to go. Um, today, as promised, I'm just going to give y'all, I told y'all I was going to tell y'all, oh, first of all, let me thank y'all, too. I've been getting a lot of love. Uh, people been commenting, saying, you know, um, they doing my routine. Um... They really appreciate the videos, uh, even getting some hate. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, I don't know where it come from unexpected, but I don't mind. You know what I'm saying? So as long as people watching out, they can hate. I don't mind. You know, I have fun with it. So, but uh, anyway, as promised, I said I'm going to get y'all where it says in the Quran and the Bible where it talks about the black seed. What it really is is the cumin seed. It's the cumin seed. Uh, we call it the black seed, but it's, it's actually the cumin seed. So I'm going to show you all where that's set in the Bible and Quran. As promised, I had a couple people ask me some quick questions uh, about the squats. Yes, every morning when I wake up, I bang out 100 body squats. Bang, bang, bang. I just I bang them straight out, 100 straight. I start out doing 50, then I do 100. I'm going I'm to try to work my way up to 250 straight every morning before I take my shower. Bang out 250. Uh, straight body squats it is essential for you men to get that testosterone moving throughout your body also for the women because you, the largest muscles in your body are in your legs that's where the fat burn comes from you ain't gonna burn the fat on your stomach by doing abs you everybody has abs it's under the fat so you got to work them large muscle groups to burn the fat so knock them squats out so yeah um, a brother commented on that. Yeah, every single morning, go ahead, bang those out, bro. Um, Push-ups every morning, I bang out 250. So I do do that every single morning. I'm gonna work my way up about 500 a morning as well. So I'm gonna start with the Quran in Sur Al Baqarah 7591. I mean, it says, "Use the black seed for indeed it is a cure for all disease except death." I mean. Uh, that's from the prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. In the Bible, Isaiah 28, 25 and 27, it says, For the black cumin is beaten out with a stick. And it goes on to say, And the cumin with a rod. Talking about the black seed. So this just goes to show that this black seed has been around for ages. Um, thousands of years, this black seed has been around. You know, so uh, if it's good enough uh, for the people in the biblical days to use and for the prophet Muhammad to say it's the cure for all except death, it's good enough for me. The health benefits are outrageous. I should have listed them. I'm talking about heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure. Check this out. I went to the doctor last week. I should have got a printout. Went to the doctor last week. Blood pressure used to be through the roof. Started working out, started exercising. It went down. So the doctor put me on a water pill. Um, hydrochlorothorazide, make me pee a lot. Got to always go to the bathroom, always go to the bathroom. So make me pee a lot. I went back to the doctor last week. He said, I can take you off the medicine. The working out uh, has helped. He said, uh, you've been working out. I got to, I can, you, can, you can stop using medicine. I ain't even telling him I was using the black seed oil. I ain't even got to take the medicine no more for the blood pressure. So blood pressure, diabetes, I mean, this thing cure so much your skin you can use it externally on your skin warts um moles anything on your skin man i mean this stuff is the real deal um somebody asked me what what they can do to help start building the core so i'm gonna just give you two quick things real quick like i said i'm great take a shower and get dressed in a minute so i can show you real quick the first thing is called a vacuum is just standing up straight standing up erect hold your stomach in uh, 15, 20 seconds. Just hold it in. All right, so look. Move this chair. So what you want to do, you just want to stand up, you ready, and you just want to squeeze it in. I can still talk while I'm doing it. You still breathe. Don't hold your breath, but push your stomach in. Push it in hard as you can. Squeeze that stomach in hard as you can. Uh, 20 seconds. So you want to do that. You want to do three sets of that. I try to do that five times a day. So I do that five times a day. The next thing I do, I ain't got a name for it. Um, I learned this in a previous lifetime. Some of you brothers know what I'm talking about. Um, 
the best thing I can describe it as is wrenching out, wringing out laundry. If you wash clothes and you, you wring it out, you wring, you, you drown it by, you wring it out, that's what you want to do to your ass. You want to stand up, spread your base just a little, and you want to twist. You want to you tighten your abs. You want to tighten them. Twist. Mm, mm, three, four, 20 sets. So I try to do it on a couple times a day as well. I do that. I do the vacuum. I do my squats. I do my push-ups. That's it right now. But like I said, next week, I'm going to hit that jump rope. Wham, 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 wham. That jump rope, uh, 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 jump that fat right off. So, uh, like I said, this is a little short video. I had a little, a little time to spare before I got to get all dressed up, go to this here uh, convention tonight, um, get you all a little jewel real quick. Like I said, if you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe, send it to a friend. You know what I'm saying? But it's right there, the Quran and the Bible. It's in there. The cure for everything but death. This thing is the real deal. So uh, thanks for the love. Like I said, thanks for the love. Thanks for the hate. I appreciate it. Uh, my man, I don't even know if it was a man or a woman, but you're more than welcome to hate some more. You know, I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? And uh, y'all be blessed out there.